am back. It's been it's been a minute, um, but I'm back and I'm here in Madrid again in Retiro Park. And can you believe that it is the end of October right now? Like this this is a little bit unreal. It did rain for a little while, but back in action here. It feels like summer, ready for some Halloween. And I have a great routine for you once again here. This is going to be your pre-gaming series stretching for the splits, okay? So we're going to do five minutes, two and a half minutes on each side that's going to bring you into the splits. And before we get started on that, um, I just wanna let you know that I am back and doing videos. There was a long break in there, I do realize that. Um, there was kind of a lot going on I started the channel and then suddenly everything just kind of shit hit the fan all at once. Um, and now things have kind of calmed down around here again, so I am back. I am doing videos. As always, I am taking requests as well. So if there are any particular videos you really want to see more than anything, let me know, leave a comment down below or on my Facebook page or somewhere and I will get cracking on that because I am back and I'm here to stay. So. Without further delaying, uh, let's get to these stretches for the splits. So I'm gonna go ahead, start on my knees here. We're going to bring the right foot forward, so nice long lunge. Hips are square over that knee, and we're just going to press down into it, and I want you to pull back. So belly pulls back from that right quad. And again, it's a little press down, pull away, squeezing that left glute. Press down, pull away. Nice deep breathing here. Exhale into it, inhale, pull back. Here we go, once more. And then I want you to go ahead, bring the hands down, take that foot wide to the outside of the mat. Hands down right here, tuck the left toes under, and we're just gonna hover here. So pushing forward onto the tips of the toes, and back. So a little press, and back. Opening that hip to the side a little bit. And if you start to feel a little bit emotional here, just know that the hips are the, dr yeah, the junk drawer, there we go, of the human body. So sometimes some of these deep hip stretches can make you feel a little bit emotional. So I want you to rest that knee down the Go ahead, bring it on to the forearms. If this is too intense, stay up on the palms, work your way down, so it is a process. And I want you to again tuck those toes, lift the knee, hold right here. And just hold, nice long inhale and exhale. You can rest that knee down as well. We're going big. We're going big to get into the splits here. But as always, take this at your own pace. So don't expect to do the splits the very first time. Go ahead, drop that knee, bring it up onto the palms now. And I want you to sit back. So hips are going to come over the knees. Hands in line with that foot. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, press that chest down toward the knee. So it's going to be head to toes chest to me, looking for that flat back. This is our last one before we go into the splits on this right side. If there's any pressure behind the knee, leave a little bit of a bend. Good for those joints. All right, and one more breath here. And then we're gonna slide into those splits. Here we go. So take it nice and slowly, hips square. Touch down here, or if you need to leave a little gap there, totally fine. Again, take this at your speed. You're not going to get in the splits that first time. So do this video, you know, maybe over the period of several months, maybe even a year. But eventually you can get down into those splits. It just takes some dedication. And hold here, one more breath. And go ahead, pull back. And we'll switch sides here. So bring that leg behind. Ah, getting a little discombobulated. And onto the left side. So left leg comes out, starting with that same little lunge here. Pressing into it, pulling back. And I'm right-handed, so this is definitely my less flexible side. 
So we'll see how this plays out. We're not really symmetric is the thing. But do what you can, work on both of those sides equally, and over time you will see it start to match up a little bit more. And go ahead, bring the hands down. Again, scoot that foot nice and wide here. Tuck the right toes under, press up here, and we're hovering forward and back. You're on a flat foot on that left foot. So a little forward. Inhaling through the nose, big exhales out through the mouth. And stretching is super important. Lots of times it's that one thing that we feel like we don't have time for. Go ahead and drop the knee here, take it all the way down. But it is so important, so make time for that stretching. And here you go, five minutes a day. So commit to it every day. And that's how you'll notice those changes. Also make sure that you are staying hydrated. That's so important for stretching. So Halloween weekend, if you're going out drinking some beers, like I plan to, make sure you're drinking water along with it. And come back up here, back into that nice hamstring stretch. So toes come up, hands on either side here, inhale long, Exhale, press it down. So chest toward that knee. Yes, hydrate. Hydration is key. Also take a multivitamin. That's a good one too. I've got all the plans for, for Halloween weekend. Oh, I thought I guess. Oh no, by the time I post this, Halloween might be over. Let's see. <laughs> And finally, into the splits on this left side. You guys are going with me here. We'll see what we can do. Easing down into it. And again, if you're not all the way down, don't worry about it. It will come in time. I'm still working on mine too. Left side is always a little bit tricky. But breathe into it. Almost there, and go ahead and release. Ooh, there we go, oh my god, there we go. Okay, bring the legs back behind. Finally, press back into a child's pose here, just letting those hips release. They should be feeling good now. And go ahead, bring it up, and there it is. Five minutes to the splits. Everybody has time to do this, but do commit do aim to do it every single day because when you take those breaks, it really hurts the flexibility. Muscle strength, you know, it will stay with you. Cardio stays a little bit longer as well. But that flexibility, you really need to commit every single day to reach those goals. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, let me know if there are any other videos that you'd like to see. And happy Halloween. See you next time. Bye.